How do you know how many books you have sold? And how do you know which books you have sold? Is there a tool where you can look up how many books and which books you have sold every day? Yes, there is. And if you want to find out, have a look at this video. Hello Home Bosses, I'm Nuria Corby from thehomeboss.com and welcome to this channel which is all about helping you to make money online. If that sounds interesting to you, click subscribe to get more videos like this. So today we're talking about how you can find out how many books you've sold and which books you have sold. Because I do get quite a few questions with people asking, where can I look up how many books I've sold? And do I get emails from Amazon to tell me when I've sold something? So the answer to the second question is no, Amazon don't send any emails when you've sold a book, but there are ways that you can find out how many books you've sold, which books you've sold, and there are also ways where you can get notifications. So today I'm just going to quickly show you which tools you can use. And the first one and the easiest one is the one that Amazon provides. And you can find that when you go on your KDP dashboard, you click on reports. We're on the reports tab now. And then you go up here at the top. It says, try the new KDP reports beta. So you click on that. So it's got a dashboard and it's very easy to then see what you've made every day. The only thing that I can't really see here, and maybe somebody knows how to do that, but I haven't found a way to do it yet. If, for example, I want to see how many sales are made yesterday, there is no way to find out. I can click on the orders tab and that will tell us um, how many books I've sold. You can also filter that so you can see how many orders you've had in the last seven days or in the last 30 days, or you can type in a custom date range. So this is one way of checking your sales. And then there's another really good um, tool that I use a lot, which is Get Book Report. And that is a Chrome extension. So you you put that in your Chrome browser. What I like about it is when you make a sale, it gives you a little ka -ching notification on your phone so that you know when you've made a sale. And the other thing I really like about it is that you can check what you've sold yesterday, last week, this month. So I find it very useful to check what I've sold the day before. And this is the one that I personally use quite a lot. It's a free extension, but once you start earning more than $1,000 a month, you have to pay. And sometimes I feel that it's a little bit buggy. It doesn't always work the way I would like it to work. And that's why I have also been looking at alternatives, because when something is free, I don't mind a few bugs here and there, but when you start paying for it and it doesn't work the way you would like it to, then obviously you start thinking, well, you know, maybe there's an alternative. But I have to say, I really like this. So far, it, it has been the best one that I have found only because I can check the sales that I made the day before. But other than that, um, the other extensions are really good as well. So this is one example, and this is the one I personally use. But as I said, I am looking for alternatives. Another one I found that's really good is Data Sprout. And Data Sprout is quite good because it gives me an estimated income for this month. So they work out what your average sales are, and then they give you an estimate of what you're going to earn for that month. But obviously that could go up or down depending on your sales. It tells you which books have sold, how many you've sold. So you find all the information here as well. And I have been using it for a little while. Um, and again, it's, oops, there was a, <laughs> another notification that I've sold something. That was book report. It plays that little sound, which I quite like <laughs> to tell me that I've sold a book. And coming back to Data Sprout, Data Sprout is the same as Get Book Report in that it's free to use, but once you hit $1,000 
in sales per month, they also start charging. So they're not free. And this leads me to one that is completely free. I only just found out about this. And that is KDP Champ. So KDP Champ is a Chrome extension as well. So I really like this because it tells you exactly how much you've sold and it sends you an email when you sell a book. So that's really handy for those of you who would like to receive some kind of notification when you sell a book. So the best thing about this is it's free. So thank you very much to the developer who developed this because it's not often that you get good tools for free. And I think that it's a really great little tool if you like to receive emails every time you sell a book. So this is a very short video just to quickly tell you about a few tools that you can use to look up your sales. And at the end of the day, we all feel happy when we make a sale. So these are the tools that I can recommend but I'm sure there are other ones. And if you know of any tools that are quite good as well, and especially if they're free, let me know in the comments so that other people can see it as well. And that would be very helpful to, to anybody who would like to have a, a, a reliable way of checking on your sales. But like I said, the first port of call should be Amazon itself. So you can go on your KDP reports beta and you can find all the information there as well. So thanks very much for watching this video and I'll see you again soon. Bye bye.